Welcome, Red Knight. Good evening, guys. Just got it back from rehearsal. Turns out I did have rehearsal today. Didn't find out till the this afternoon, pretty much, but it went good. I was thinking it would be lovely to stream, but it was not quite appropriate. So we'll look forward to future days where we can do that, future streams of fun rehearsals and stuff like that. Or perhaps the performance can get a stream of that even. We shall see. We shall check it out. Anyway, let's get to a little bit of Hogwarts time for the time we do have. Hopefully a solid hour here. Continue on with Anthral. They're good fun. Other good times. Uh, we shall see and take a look at it as we progress and enjoy. Going great fun times last night. Alucard Tardis with the nine month resub. Joined as well by Lunatic with some fun uh, channel rewards. Other good times like that I was considering showing the uh, Lenny stream here tonight, but internet can't really handle two things at once and other things with uh, family and such, certain Star Trek or other such things, or dark materials will not really allow that for well optimized. So we'll look forward to that in due course. Good point. I'll find a good opportunity to do that here, uh, hopefully somewhat soon, because we do want to return to Red Dead. But I was hoping to you know, even beat GTA 5 or do some online GTA briefly so not too big of a rush for that we're enjoying fun with hogwarts and skyrim for now micro chapter seven i believe should be set up for sub saturday tomorrow sunday may be off because of good auditions other preparations so yeah chapter seven tomorrow for sure sub saturday for micro look forward to that and everything else should be coming along here good hogwarts on the way fun times with that and we'll figure out other good things positive course and positive time so look forward to it continue to attempt to export other editing and video creation in the background so we'll have that here as needed turn up the keyboard brightness that's always nice to have for a gladiator computer other situation like that to be sure so all good funny times a little mishap I started a stream last night with that uh, super clean gel, so that was quite interesting. But we're moving on here, on to good fun. 
and good times. Let's go ahead and begin the fun adventures here for at least a little good while tonight. On we go. Good bit more of this fun action for this fantastic Friday. And then sub Saturday soon to begin tomorrow. All looking good on mine. I will continue to test stream here and there. <sighs> oh, Coco and all the rest. Yeah, talking with them. That's all right. Yep, got what we need. Looking good. Yeah, Steam looking, stream looking stable on my end. I think we'll be fine for now. Continue on with Anthro here. Soon to return to Bryn. Level 25, pretty much set for now, so... <sighs> On we go, a little bit of that uh, ball-pulling tournament, <laughs> whatever it is. Merlin's balls, the other uh, charms class balls. Plenty of balls in this game. All right. On we go, good bit of fun here. For the time that we do have tonight. Looking great, great enough. Interesting fun. I inspect your character for the first rehearsal tonight. Seeing some good snow and good friends, good reading. Generally speaking, see if the other audition did want to read some of that Shakespeare tonight. We'll do it multiple times tomorrow, sub Saturday. Could ring it out now, but I think we'll just enjoy a good bit of adventures for Hogwarts for the time we do them. Let's read it at least two or three times tomorrow, then. In before micro, after micro. And before the end of stream would probably be a good point for that. I'll read it off stream a bit here tonight. Love to have some Google glasses or such to actually stream the things I see, such as in performance or rehearsal. If we just had those, like, you know, camera, eye tracking cameras, so I thought that'd be awesome to stream uh, almost 24 7 for that. <laughs> Everything that is appropriate for stream, but, uh, yeah. That technology just isn't quite there or readily available to the masses, at least. It's probably there. I've seen Google Glass like over a decade ago, but. It's not readily available to the masses yet, so... Sadly, I pretty much do fall into that category of the common people in the masses. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Dragon Knights. Dragon Champions here. If there's... Broadcast stable at Hogwarts Legacy. Continue on for good fun. And here we are for uh, Melda. Let's go ahead and do Samantha Dale. Tournament first. I like to get that initial uh, j jitteriness out of the way. Incendio. Anyway, can encourage that to stop. It was better. This is high graphics, and the fire still doesn't even look that convincing. But you would prefer it if I stopped that. Well, just wait till I get a bar of Kadabra, huh? Just wait till we get the curses. You don't really want me to stop that. Especially the Slytherin character. We're not going to go to Azkaban permanently for either of the. Students, I'm pretty sure you can avoid that, and it's probably just like a little cutscene before you reload or something. I have no idea. We'll see that when we can come to it. For now, Samantha. Hello, Samantha. Are you here for Summoners. I am. I'm actually rather I am. Used to play all the time with my brother until. Oh, never mind. Shall we begin? Okay. I'm ready. Yes, I'm ready to play. Then let's get summoning. Let's get summoning. Just keep summoning. Frame drop looking excellent. I'll continue to test here and there. Broadcast stability. Look forward to chat with you soon. Oh, what are these? Gravity wells? Yeah, I was wondering. Oh boy. Those are those are a new obstacle. Those are damn tough to avoid those. How am I gonna get I mean they're the same place the entire round? Yeah, I've never seen these before, so. They're in the same place this entire round. How do we actually avoid that? You might just want to go for 10 here, honestly. Let me get the first one to 10 and go from there, I guess. No, that didn't work. It's already gonna sneak it away. You can only do the one. Oh, you get it in the middle, though. This one in the middle is off the court, though. So yeah, 20 might really be the best we can go for. Let's see what she does with my ball. Oh, she actually managed to traverse it there. That was good. So it's traversable. It's just tough. Alright, so 10 points on me. Let's make up for that right away. With, I guess, this one to start. Let's try to nudge hers a little bit, but not too much. This could go bad. Let's see what happens. Alright, both to 50. At least we're tied in that sense, but... All depends on her next ball. All depends on her next ball here, because she is still in the 
will be in the lead in this ball. All right, she got to 50. All right, I have to get 50 on this one too. Well, we are out of it. Yes! <laughs> 50 and I will win because of her ball out. It's all in the precision here. If I just knock her ball out, I'll win though, so. I might be a little more aggressive than usual. Yep, doesn't matter. <laughs> I still have more balls on the court. That does settle there. And thrall. Alrighty. Interesting gravity wells. Not seen that before. Appears I overestimated myself. One with Bryn, lost with him in the second round, so that's a unique dialogue whether you win or lose there. That's good. More like you underestimated me. That was your mistake. Fair enough. But a little Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw. I happen to know who you're up against next, and she's no shy opponent. Best of luck. All right. I hope we will come back to that later. So in this court, I'm still going to uh, slither in Miss. Uh, Is it still tracking the quest? I feel like it stopped tracking the quest. I feel like I'm completely out of control here. Let's take a look just for the actual quest accompaniment here. Um, you know, we have several things to do around here before we really leave. So one, one thing might take us to another, but yeah, Melda still a ways off. Uh, who is this? Oh, that's Imelda. The other main quest is there just for the class or whatever. She's not too far away, but not in the grounds for sure. Well, we'll get there. Oh, the balloons. That'll probably be for her. Well, probably not her challenge, but they don't actually matter if you don't need them, I think. So just extra pa practice, basically. A bit hard to control, but I will try. Need to sprint here. Oh man. Sometimes, yeah, just the path is a bit more straightforward. These are not. Thankfully, it's not timed or anything. It's just working on our broom accuracy, which is pretty difficult. Like, it's not moving in the way you expect it to, and you have to do the movement keys a lot more than the mouse. The mouse is just the camera, basically. I'm used to the mouse being more direct control, not just the camera. Then again, I've probably driven more on console, maybe. It depends. Oh, pop balloons for out of five. Where's the fifth one there? Don't stop now. There's got to be a fifth one here. How would it give me four out of five? I don't believe it. <laughs> I don't see any. Oh, that's weird. They keep exploding even after the fact. Yep, not in the area that I can see. The camera doesn't let you go up and down. It's only side to side, so you really have to just use your elevation to your benefit. Negative 15.6 decibels. We might want to turn up the game a tad bit here. Yeah, I hope the dialogue wasn't too quiet. Sorry. Ah, here we go. Start for the left side then. Yeah, some games just louder than others. Hand of Fate a little loud last night after we left off of this, so... Did not have any cheesy death explosion. Here we go. Should be for the challenge. It needed five, and that was the fifth one. Aw, oh, crap. Just gotta readjust. It's hard, you know? You think you're, like, pinpoint. Accuracy. Hit a ranger with stupefy. Oh boy. Oh, this should be interesting. Give me that chest. Oh, jeez. Destroyed my sack. Stupefy and slice a frozen enemy. That'll be for the brand new uh, spell there. That's not a ranger. I need though. 
Get pretty far away. Yeah. Oh boy. Where are they? Oh, there he is. Sentinel. Just only have the range of the slice of frozen in me I can do. That's a warrior. Let me slice him. First time I've sliced a frozen enemy. Still no rangers. That is pretty powerful. I just need the right spell bar for it. I feel like I'm not the best possible spell bar. Well, come on over, why don't you? <laughs> this is funny. That is pretty funny. Can't open the gate, that's not good. Fly over. Come on over. Oh, yeah, there's the ranger I need. Alright, stupefy the ranger. Give me the chance. Come on over first. Crossbow shouldn't do too much damage. Still need that stupefy on him, so. As soon as he gives me the chance. And there it is. Alright, good to go. They know pretty powerful. Let's experiment while we have the advantage. There's no Petrificus Totalis once they have discovered you, but you can still do it with Glacius. So that is interesting. Ranrock has fooled you all to your demise. Alright, looking good with everything we have in the present moment. Eyes open, zealous, omen, passion, consciousness. Good to go for Friendly Friday. Rebellion. I don't think there's much here, just that extra area. We already started this one, I just couldn't find all of Merlin's artifacts. She is quite the ways away. I should have flew powder after all. If it's over a thousand, you should probably flew powder. But I didn't mind just to warm up for the little bit. <laughs> Time we have, make the best half hour remaining, at least for some good progress. But let's see what we have here. Plenty of ash winders. These guys first, though. Nice and close by. None shall be the wiser. That's all right. On to the next. Bad idea to decloak him. Yeah. Oh, got the ancient magic though. Take a quick look. Where it's leading me. Wrong one. <laughs> Dangerous. Oh yeah, we've already defeated these guys, but here we go again, I guess. Not the best programming there, but <laughs> works for me, you know. Might as well climb to him, I guess. Where are the two other ones? All the way up or something? Or down below. It shows them on the map, doesn't seem like they're actually there. Oh. That's interesting. Did he come down there? <laughs> yeah. Well, wherever the other two are, they're probably all the way up there. It might be the spiders up there, actually. Let's get that ancient magic, see what it does. If I can actually read it this time, that would be nice. You get uh, each part of that. You get the upgrade for the bar eventually. I don't know. There's the next one. Easier to fly up than to walk up. There's another way in this tower here. Oh. <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. That's fine. Yeah, I've already looted. Chest and such. Just hatchlings, so. Incendio will do the trick there. Do want to try some Defendo, though? That's it. Good enough. 
Next one there, just the platform there. Get that out of the way now that they're dealt with. Uh, head back there, I guess. See what it says. No, there's still another one in the area then. Where could it be? Right there. <laughs> Alright. That's easy enough. Easy enough indeed. Switch on over. Check it out. Check it up. Enjoy the adventure. Call your mount. Yeah, we'll ride the hippogriff later. Won't be much space at all. There you go. On to the last little beacon. Now it should tell us what this actually does. I have not actually discovered that for the challenge. It might tell you ancient magic traces. You're gonna remind me what it is? No. Well, it's still ancient magic traces, so. There's things in the world that is helpful to get whatever it actually does. Moving on to Melda, we'll do other stuff on the way. Melda, you are in that direction. Okay. Swing around with that little firebolt or such. Yeah, I'll probably do the house broom for the Bryn, so. Fire dragony one for him is nice. Ooh, the butterflies in the forest. We did have that dark forest uh, quest line for them. Don't know if these are the right ones or not, but Lumos. we can try. Follow the butterflies. See where they're going. I had a uh, alchemy or something there. Launched two enemies simultaneously with the pulso, and there you have it. Ah, oh, I killed them too. Yeah, those are very. Strong and something revealed here with the butterflies for a stuffed toy dragon. <laughs> nice. Well, that's fun. All right. Well, that was extra f butterflies. There must be a different one for that actual side quest to follow the butterflies, see where they lead, basically. But it's good for that one. Get my moonstone. Who do we have here? More mongrels. Slice a frozen enemy again. Well, it's too late for anything else. Wrong one. They aren't too tough. But yeah, I just like to freeze him, so he gets you uh, ready for that. <laughs> there you go. Slice another frozen enemy. Does the trick. If you know what the spell does, I feel like that would be hard for beginners who haven't played many games or know much grammar, because they wouldn't necessarily know the Defendo is a slicing spell. But if you research it and you use common sense, you will eventually connect the dots. Alright, plenty of stuff on the map. But I'm just headed to broom training. Uh, poachers. Apparently, already know I'm here. Have one of these. Man, they like to surround me. It's not going the one I target, so I guess I do need to use caps lock now and then. Just too hard to manage otherwise. I'm literally locked on him and you're still not attacking him. What is going on? Oh, oh, well. Get my random Protego here. This is interesting. Good enough. Your poaching days are over. Should just use ancient magic, but oh here we got the nice little bird. Let's set him free. That's just fine. Great. There you have it. Good to go. 
Yeah, birds set free. You cannot collect them or tame them or anything at the moment, but we still did Rebellion. good deed in itself, I believe. Set them free from the poachers, so yeah, that's definitely good. Set them being extorted and sold. Oh, unforgivable. We'll see what that is. That's probably something for the curses. Oh, we got something else up here. I know what that means. Money trial. Still don't have that level 27 here. They come after me, they'll rest in ten. Still don't have malice. We disturb the poachers and Amagus. Reducto cast with Depulso. That seems pretty challenging, but I guess I should try it once I uh, stealth kill this last one here. Alright, they won't probably kill him. He is high level, so let me just make sure. Ah, oh, never mind. <laughs> it's higher level, but not that much. I'd rather not mess with the Animagus there. Kind of tough reason. We did get some better gear there. We'll take a look at that in just a moment. Wait, I thought I had that nugget. Okay. And this was over there too. Yep. Good enough. Push the magic boat button. Open the magic lock. The green bird fooper. Another fooper. Set free. He's not tamed, but he'll still be free now. If we follow him, I am curious. I've just been curious. A lot of the NPC pathing, just for the sake of it. Nothing else here, a chest and stuff. Why don't we just follow them for a little while and then come back? They fly free to Hogsmeade or whatever that is that I can't intermounted, so I'm not gonna track them very efficiently on foot. We have uh, a food guy. For Doxy Egg. Stolen by poachers for use in potions, these black eggs come from a Doxy, a magical beast sometimes mistaken for a fairy. That's pretty cool. Oh, whose face do we have here? I'm not sure how to interact with that, but. Interesting. Now there's something here. Oh, yeah, we did get that gear and another. Updated like perk or updated upgrade for clothes, but I did not actually do that yet, so we'll see. Pit Moonstone doesn't hurt. Can't jump on simple boxes. For some reason, it's really hard to do. Should be a bit easier to do that, but it is what it is. Let's take a look at the gear. Do you have certain upgrades? With something in the upgrade itself, you yeah, have to find a way to do that. Oh yeah, this one out leveled. I think that was it, right? Could have sworn I got something better, but it is yeah level cap. So something yeah, like this is better, but not till the next level, level 25, level 26. We're on the verge of it, but yeah. That's fine. Why not do some extra saving just because? Uh, Hufflepuff students sweeping the competition. Let's, uh. What do you have in store for me this time? Keep moving on. Rebellion. Nothing in store without Mallow Sweets, so if I can get the seeds for that and I go back to the seed place. Alright, is she actually in here then? Yeah, there's no way to get to her. Without walking, let's see. Ah, oh, it's just past that. I must be Hogsmeade. Then let me take a look. I'm a bit disoriented where I actually am. That's not Hogsmeade. It's the only place I've seen. Yeah, the actual. You know, yeah, Hogsmeade's all the way up there. So the only thing I've seen that anti-flight enchantment on. So interesting. Soar with the eagles. Uh, wonder why you can't fly there. Interesting. But anyway, she's down here. Talk to her for now. Mr. Wheat wasn't wrong about the mountain views. If it isn't the fastest Hufflepuff. The fastest Hufflepuff. Nice, she does. Uh, next to that, we've got a negative uh, A point now. See how that is. Want a good balance between the dialogue, the sound effects, 
and still hear me re relatively well over it, but a lot of the time I would rather the game be louder than it is, at least in my experience watching streams like Witcher and such, which are, you know, sometimes naturally quieter. And a Quidditch robe, alright, take a quick look at that. Gear simulator, loot simulator. We do have some extra offense on the Quidditch row. That looks pretty cool. I guess we might as well do the flight course with that and go back to the Dragon Main right after. But since we're flying anyway, kind of fitting to have <laughs> Hufflepuff Quidditch row. Here we go. Hello, Imelda. So, another trial? Of course it's another trial. And you'd better be taking part. Does this mean you've changed your mind about me? Well, you're a step up from the good-for-nothings who usually challenge me. While they sit around and hope to be the best, I put in hours of practice. No one sets records by wishing for them, and I need strong competition to stay on top of my game. Are you going to try to beat my flying record or not? We'll try. Strong comp. Strong competition? Could that have been a compliment, Amelda? Oh, Go ahead, believe what you want. It makes no difference. Compliments make people soft. No one goes around telling me I did a fine job. Do I care? No. I say I'm the best and that's all I need. So please, try to beat my record, God. fifth year. And don't be disappointed when you lose. I'm ready to fly. Finally, a decent challenge. Fly away on my cell phone. All right, this might be a bit tricky, but it's at least through the hoops. There's the mirror match, basically the mirror. A little, uh... Just there, wow. Not going very fast at all. <laughs> now that's more like it. Make it. Get the bubble, get the damn bubble. Oh, jeez, it's swervy as heck. A bit hard to control. <laughs> Oh man, it's really tricky. It's not as all smooth as you would expect it to be. It is quite hard to be precise here when it's only the arrow keys, the direction keys. I'm lucky just to not miss the hoops. The bubbles are another thing. It is not at all as precise as you would like it to be. But as long as you don't run out of the extra stamina bar, you should at least pass the damn challenge and move on. I'm not going to become a professional broom flyer anytime soon. This is, this is way harder to control than you imagine it to be. Just not enough finesse. I don't know. Uh-oh, we lost the extra turbos. Yeah, you do need that extra that extra bar filled because otherwise it even distracts you with other icons and things. It distracts you with Merlin things. Stuff like that. That doesn't help. But yeah, you do need that extra yellow bar, because that's like the real turbo, the real extra speed. And if you don't have that, you are going slower at a regular sprint. So, yeah, it gives you a little bit of extra. I believe this is the fastest we can go. No penalties is ideal, of course. It is hard to be precise. It's quite a bit harder than the original Prisoner of Azkaban uh, Hippogriff flying that you did it there in that game, so... It's quite a step above. The more we do it, the better we'll get, I guess. Maybe I'll learn a trick or two to make it a little less grueling. I've got this. Under two minutes, so definitely a good standard. You know, we can do better than that, but as far as it goes, that's pretty good. As far as the just difficult controls go, it's <laughs> about the best I could do with, the, with what I know, what I have. Oh, nice of you all to show up. You've improved, I must admit. That was a bloody good run. Looked like she was doing sign language. Of Earn a reputation for talent around here, and some people get put out about it. Sounds like you're speaking from experience. Yes, well, I am. Anyway, you didn't do abysmally. I can't deny that. But you'll not have the same luck on the South Coast course. Who's been put out? You said your reputation for talent put some people out. Like whom? Hmm. If you must know, I've had to deal with jealousy from members of my own house. 
When we were first years, Nerida Roberts and I spent loads of time on our brooms, pledged to fly every day. As my skill on a broom grew, rapidly I might add, Nerida suddenly didn't have time for flying practice. I tried to give her pointers, but she didn't have the natural ability I did. Clearly, she was jealous. Her thing spends all her time now dawdling by the lake, obsessed with mer people. Won't even learn to swim. I refuse to downplay my talents to coddle someone else's fragile ego. <sighs> anyway, I need to ready the next course. Stop by when it's ready, if you can handle ready it. We'll see, won't we? Till next time. <laughs> I half expected you to back down. Rest on your laurels. See you at the South Coast trial, if you don't lose your nerve. To it eventually. Race this course again. Not... Visit the podium with the leaderboard. Time where sensitive. Where you can start the race and check your time. Let's just take a look at it real quick. Leaderboard. Another successful wow. flight. Wow. I should let Mr. Weeks know. I wonder, yeah, no matter what your time is, if people are ahead of you. Because they always want to give you room for improvement. Interesting. Well, I did miss a couple bubbles, so we can definitely improve on that. Huh. Kind of curious if we can beat Ruby right away. I don't know, I just feel like it is bloody difficult to control. For some reason. Hmm. It's easier when you're not trying to actually go like through hoops and stuff and you just want to fly free. Huh. Well, once more one hurt, I guess, now that it gave us the time to beat. Alright, let's see if we can get five extra seconds off that time. Every second counts in these type of things. So that's my previous time or, or what? How is it going so much faster? Probably because I didn't press shift. I have no idea. Going so much faster though. Mysterious and a bit of brilliant. Well, might as well give up already. <laughs> this is tough. Yeah, you just can't turn sharply enough. Oh man. Well, we'll come back to it at some point. For now, because I saw him just take off there so fast, it's like, well, I know I'm not going to beat that. <laughs> just, yeah, the matter of precision is quite difficult to actually turn into. And I just didn't press shift at the beginning, so that doesn't make sense. It doesn't start you off at top speed. Just little nuances like that. Well, we're halfway. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna make it, but just for the sake of learning. Yeah, look how far behind I am. The uh, ghost image in the front. I mean, you just saw in the very first ring they were going faster, so I guess you do have to just press shift. And yeah, I stopped at the beginning. That definitely was not gonna work. So maybe we'll do one more time for now. Get rid of it. Yeah, the start of the race sometimes determines the whole rest of it. Not for everything, but certain things like this where it's very specific. Every little thing you miss, every connection, makes all the difference. I'm trying to swerve like that less, but it's pretty hard to control. Yep, matter of seconds, you know. Just that last little push, holding it down. No success. Yeah, I did it actually a little worse than my first time. So we might as well keep trying. Learn what is to be learned. So I have my best time. So yeah, just pressing shift at the beginning makes all the difference. Let's see if we can do that. Shift. Because yeah, if I'm not beating the dummy in the beginning, why are they so much faster? That doesn't make sense unless they have just some upgrades or something I don't know about. It's not like I'm stopping. It does not make any sense to me how they can be that fast that early. So we're we'll about to come back to this. That makes no sense. How do you quit this, by the way? Return, yeah. Let me return. Missed it. Yeah, I do not need to do that again. It just doesn't make sense to me. How can it be the same exact, you know things affecting the speed and they still be twice as fast. 
that er that early. That's weird. Anyway, that was quite a far way off the castle. I probably should have done that later. Serona and Hogsmeade, Alby and Hogsmeade. Don't have enough. I thought I had more than that. I thought it says at zero out of nine. I got two recently. What are you talking about? Adelaide is in. Where is this? Hogwarts as well? Yeah. Adelaide is in Hogwarts. Tale of Roland Oaks for Adelaide Oaks. Cursor decided to disappear. That's nice. Shift tab, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I'll head to her in a moment. Oh, man. Let me switch back gear here. I think we can do better for the clothes as well. I don't really know. Oh yeah, I like that one for a bit. That was actually pretty good. Don't remember I switched to the other one, but what happened for natural gear progression. All right, so we have castle, we have Hogsmeade, treasure. Still don't have a mandrake. Might as well yeah, follow the butterflies now, since that's elsewhere. I'll be weeks. Maybe somewhere else. I don't know. How far away is this one? Two thousand away. Well, let me just take care of that since it's a nice little side quest. Yeah, it's two thousand away. Here we have a uh, base of maneuver for Athea Twiddle. Something fascinating. Where did that come from? I might as well go to that, I guess. Yeah, track that. It's a track. It doesn't really look like it. <laughs> That's a lot closer than the forest. We do to that next. She's literally right down the road here, so why not check that out? Still Hufflepuff spirit. Rebellion. Right. The Hufflepuff vest and all. These weird things. It's for the Merlin trial. Malice Sweden eventually did, of course. Rebellion. What do you have for me here? Behind the wall. Sagal is a nice uh, wand handle there. Pretty good looking one. I don't know, should we switch wand handles so it doesn't make much difference? That well used wand getting so bright <laughs> malleable. <laughs> Nose, mouth, sweet up for you. This time, Nothing from Merlin. No malice sweet from Merlin. Be right with you there. Rebellion. Althea. You need lots of snacks. You like snacks. Okay. I'll be right there. There's something here, yeah. Other side of it. Is that level two? Of course it is. Ah, oh, the flute powder though. Definitely need that. How nice to see you, my young friend. All right. We may as well carry on. Don't remember oh, her, but oh, I love good puzzles. I don't. I don't like puzzles. Let's see. Excuse me, madam. I thought I heard you say something. Yes, indeed. Talking to myself again, I find myself to be quite the engaging conversationalist since my husband passed. Madam Althea Twiddle, pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Madam Twiddle. Althea will you be also glad to quite see her. interested in this. You young people love this sort of thing. My husband often ruminated on the mysterious statue just outside our hamlet. Some sort of archaic puzzle involving vases, he would insist. I stumbled upon it today when I had a burst of energy and extended my morning constitutional a bit longer than usual. There comes a little frame drop at last. I was beginning to wonder, are we gonna get any... How likely are you to recommend a Windows PC to others if asked? All right, broadcast is stable. Look forward to chat with you soon. We did not get voice mod test I meant to. How about some tea pain for you tonight? There you go. 
And yeah, broadcast stable, chat with you soon, frame drop under 1%, which is lovely here for Dragonite Anthal Prorvin. I do enjoy a good puzzle. I'm not a fan of puzzles. Let's at least be an honest Hufflepuff. Maybe we can lie with uh, Bryn, just for variety's sake. <laughs> but for now, I will be honest. <laughs> I'm afraid I don't find puzzles that engaging. Ah. I find them frustrating. However, you might feel otherwise when I tell you a bit more about the rumors surrounding this particular one. My husband Greville insisted that solving the puzzle would reveal a magical challenge of sorts. The man was intrigued by everything. He was about to try and solve it himself when... <sighs> Perhaps you could take a look. I'd be rather interested to hear what, if anything, you find. Where that statue? Where can I find this statue? It's not far from Irondale. It's down by the shore, near those old ruins. You can't miss it. Speaking of statue. What did I name this one again? It was so recently, I forgot. I know I put... Maybe I didn't actually... Add it to the sound list? Could that be possible? Oh boy. I might not have added that. I really thought I did. That's weird. Oh well, we'll add it now. I could have sworn I added that. That's so weird. Didn't add it even to soundless? That's one I forgot apparently. Okay. Well, let's add it now. I was doing that for stream reverse here session. I just completely passed this one for some reason. Yeah, it's not here, is it? Oh, well, we'll get it ready for tomorrow. Just take a moment. Uh, yeah, it should be here somewhere. Where is it? I never actually got it. Huh, how about that? All right, well, I'll uh, get there ready for tomorrow. I don't want to mess with the frame drop it for now. But yeah, first thing tomorrow for stream anniversary, we will have uh, <laughs> that extra command, that extra sound command. Actually forgot that. Stromversary 2 announcement, yeah. Rope whip sig, Johnny, yes, sad, toss a coin, yes. High two, high twenty-three, I think they just high two. Yeah, I actually forgot that one. I skipped over it. So we'll get that for tomorrow for sure. I don't want to mess with stream frame drop because while it's not particularly long, it'll still add a few percent frame drop. We only have like a minute to enjoy it. We'll just get a first thing tomorrow. That's the best thing to do from what I can tell. So New sound, new command coming tomorrow. If I happen to see it, I'll have a look. Ah, the spirit of youth. I do hope you'll be able to solve the puzzle. If not for me, then in Greville's memory. In the meantime, forgive me. Let me make up with, make up for it with rope two. Find Madame Twiddle's I mysterious look into statue. The statue Madame Twiddle mentioned. Let's take a look. Now you're a hero. You managed to. The whole damn game We're happy you made it But how are you gonna spend the rest of this day? Maybe watch a video Maybe press refresh and start again Wait for me and where? There's no layer here Oh well, it's kind of a nice area What is this, I wonder? Speaking of puzzles, yeah, that does not look like something you can just unlock for the sake of it. Let me yeah, interact with it some other way. But we'll figure that out here soon. Alright, stable broadcast, fine enough for now. Mysterious statue with a general location. Room upgrade. Why did I just refill my stamina there? This looks like the statue Madam Twiddle mentioned. I can't figure out why I have infinite stamina all of a sudden. Oh, frogs. Slice a dangling dug bog. Let's get them dangling, why shall we? Why are around here? 
Good for you. Glacier. First thing is to get them dangling, so... That was close. Thankfully, they're not close enough. Slice you good. Got it. That's a lot of damage, too. Cut his tongue off. That's the way to kill these damn dug bugs. He figured it out. I knew he'd just use the ancient magic. But yeah, that is way more effective. There's a decent amount of damage, but yeah, cutting their tongues off, there is no better way than that. So we know that now. Get your damn tongue. Maybe you cut off the tongue, it's more likely to drop. But it got on the one that I didn't cut off, so... I feel like that can't be... How about this one? Slice a frozen enemy. This probably won't kill him. If it does, I'll do that one. Yep, didn't kill him. close. I'm just, yeah, training myself not to always go for the tongue, because it is better. Got the chip. What? That didn't count. It wasn't actually frozen. So you have to do a quick sequence of the Leviosa. So the freeze. Yeah, it's a very quick freeze on them, so... You pretty much have to do that right away. But still didn't count. Yeah, it doesn't count them as frozen. Crazy. Well, let's see if these guys are somehow more freezable. Not likely, but... Does he see me? I feel like he saw me. Is he alerted after that or not? I'm curious. Guess not. Yeah, such a quick little window to freeze him. Let's try one more time. Oh, wrong order there. Yeah, I just need to go up, but I hit the other one. What is he just staring at me for? Ah, oh, cool down. Such a quick window there. I don't know if it's possible, because even though they seem to be frozen, they're apparently not. Alright, two bars up. Still doesn't count. I guess it's not possible then. I think he just bugged out, honestly. <laughs> Very funny. Alright, let's practice the best way to do it, which is... That into that. Oh, cool down, you're killing me. Yeah, it's hard to freeze them. But a rock to the head will also solve that. Alright, activate the statue. Bit of extra fun with the frogs. The grouse, free as a bird. Oh, we do have some more vendors. I don't really need to, but since she's here, tread well. Hello. Do you have anything for sale? It's the sister. Hello. It's not often I see how good students are during the school year. I'm Priya Treadwell at your service, and I sell a variety of traveling necessities. Are you related to Nora Treadwell? Why, yes, she's my wife. The Merlin. Brilliant historian. Did you know that she's pursuing Merlin's life's work? I actually met her and she introduced me to her work. I'm involved in it now as well. <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. Then you must be rather brilliant no, as well. Sweet. At any rate, I hope that you'll think of me whenever you find smells. yourself in need of traveling supplies. It's been a pleasure meeting you. Let me actually buy some. What do you have for sale? I'll think of my... Let's have a look, shall we? Mallow sweet. There we go. Definitely you don't need to buy a uh, moonstone. But yeah, the more mallow sweet I can get even if it's buying it. Don't really need did any. Family antique broom. I guess that's just an extra broom type or something. If you like an old broom, there you go. <laughs> All right, Mandrake, I've been needing a long time. He's out you against multiple enemies. I can promise you that. I can live without most of these, I believe. Let's go ahead and sell anything extra. <laughs> I well. didn't think I'd be the one doing the buying. So ironic. Okay. This one is slightly better, so... Keep that for next level, I guess. Even though it's so green. Nice you to stop by. 
Still on the statue, yeah, the Mandrake. The challenge for that, I believe, is to use on multiple enemies. Let's just confirm here for... Yeah, the one we've had for a long time. Acquire and use a Mandrake on multiple enemies simultaneously. So as long as they're around me, I believe it should work. Mandrake will last for a while. Shrieks when unearthed. Mandrakes can be used to stun and harm enemies in a radius. Seeds can be purchased, can be grown in pots of huh. any size. Yeah, let's try it on these guys. Why not? Who would a nice mushroom stew about now? Ha! Huh. Just got the dueling feed for a two, so. As long as they got the two of them. The I'll go ahead and break your shield first. And here it is. Yes! Success! They didn't like that. They didn't like that too much, did they? Man, this. Decapitation. You only have Ranrock to blame. For the last one that messed him up. Oh boy. Embedded in the stone. Alright, looking good enough. What do they got here? Lace swings. Might as well when they're so easily accessible. Oh, we've got even more baddies up here, though. This is a whole fortress. I guess I'm just procrastinating the quest, but this is, yeah, a whole foundry. I'm definitely here too early. <laughs> We're supposed to come here later, I bet. Landing unavailable, it says. An intruder, you haven't even seen me. You freaking magical detection bastards. Do you have, like, Revenio. alert system? They haven't actually seen me, so... Plenty of goblins up in here, and we have more butterflies over there. Yeah, let me avoid them for now. Get to the butterflies after we take care of the dirty work. That's pretty difficult positions, but we'll take it patiently. We'll be just fine. I'd rather not fight that many at once. I mean, you know, could go for them. Just a difficult angle, because they're cheating out so much, but let's try to get the double. For now. Yep, just one at a time. There's more in the tenter below, yeah. Below, looks like. One at a time. Almost got suspicious there. really noticed them disappearing, so just keep it up. I'll be just fine. One by one. I'll also use the distraction, so if we can do that, that's good. He's more dangerous, so yeah. Take care of him and the common warrior. Basic warrior, <laughs> and then we're already down to the last of the bunch, pretty much. We didn't have a dueling feat here, so, so that's just fine. Revenge. Shows a lot more below or something, but I believe I'm clear for now. See, the frames are a little slacking, but it's probably just a big area. Even with shadows off, it's not super smooth. Probably still don't appreciate the graphics that were put into it, so. Guess could do the butterflies now since they're right here. Then we'll come down for the other parts of the base. Hello. Lumos. Where are you leading to? I don't know why I guess Lumos thinking they're like the moths. They're not. They're not moths. Where are you taking me though? Up and up. Up and away. Up and over. Ah, oh, we got a poor creature needs some help. I don't know where the measle. Alohomora. Nice kitty will set you free. And the frames and are working a little hard. That's why it's get a good computer deal with a bit less than it would be on a standard computer. Quite a bit of difference there. Makes a whole lot of difference. All right, off you go, Neasel. The butterflies brought me to a freestanding clock. Thank you, butterflies. More beasts, other things nearby, but for now, dealing with the goblins and such. Revelio. 
As soon as they're underground, it must be like, yeah, an elaborate area. Seems like there's a few here. Yeah, there they are. Let's get on this platform, perhaps. Oh, yeah. Could just pick them off from the top, but where's the rest over here first? Yeah. Deal with them first. Just the one there. By a bit. Ambush. Upgrade thing. Rest her directly below. Right on top of him. That's fine. Can't be afraid with stealth execution. Sometimes you just gotta go for it, hope for the best. If it messes up, at least you have the option to fight normally. Unlike sticks, speaking of goblins, sticks, you do not have the option to fight. You're a weak goblin in that <laughs> against humans, so. Sticks not quite my style. We might come back to it at some point. I might just uninstall it. Consider it one for, you know, honorable mention, but not really too much on stream. It's fine. Dishonored, though, probably my favorite style one. It's just a lot of fun. Okay, okay. what do we have here? Cinnamon Bock. It seems that at least one goblin finds the food at this encampment at, at bit bland. <laughs> A bit bland, I meant to say, and is taken to adding cinnamon bark to their stew to liven it up. Not bad at all. Alright, there we go. Statue still nearby. Still want to clear a bit more of these out. Yeah, I said it might be easier just to take them out from up top, so if it does go wrong, it seems better to lead with stealth so you don't have to kill them all individually, just so much quicker to get their health bar down. But if it doesn't work out, I'll go back up top and use that uh, high ground advantage. That seems just fine, but for now, they're not too vigilant. This is just easier. Slow, loyalist assassin. Might have already. Oh, here we go. Perfect. There you have it. Yeah, these guys are not particularly expertise. Oh, in the water you go. Oh, he actually does drown. That's a nice surprise. <laughs> wow. Interesting. All right, well, cleared out this area, whatever it is. Just some kind of fortress. I don't think there's many more loots to be had, so... On we go. There's a treasure cave here and balloons. Might as well get those. Probably for the actual tournament. But nice if that counted for the future upgrades. It is hard, yeah, to turn left to right like that. Switching. Oh, I'm out of uh, stamina there. Switch to regular shift. It is just fine, though. A lot of balloons here. I don't know if it's really worth it, but now I get pop balloons one out of ten. I don't really know what it's based on. And yeah, it's weird, it gives me like infinite stamina randomly, and then it doesn't. Boom controls. Okay. It's back to Feldcroft. I'll just pop them on my way back to the statue, whatever else. In that vicinity. It. I did get mallow sweets, so maybe maybe I should start this one. I don't know if I can do anything with that, but well, no, until I find out, you only have to activate these once anyway, so might as well finally get to have some mallow sweets. What do I do with you, though? That's the question. Oh, blow it up. All right. <laughs> Guess that's what it wanted. I hope so. I have no idea where to start with some of these. Ah, oh, got my 
frogs. Slice and dangling duck bog. Can't do it on that one for whatever reason. Arrest the moment. That was close. That'll kill him. That's the best way to do it. Just in time, even though I took the hit. Doesn't matter. Don't have time for that, but we have plenty of ancient magic. Yeah, that's the way to do it. Okay, got the challenge. Uh, there's two of those statues. Let me look for more. Check whatever cottage this is. What have we got here? Place just for the fireplace. That's nice. Curious metal bows. So we got two of the statues. There are bound to be more somewhere, such as that one. Alright, that's three of them. How many more could there be? Set the ancient magic free. Ah. All the way up here, we got this platform too. Do not know what that does, but wow, is that kind of disorienting with the effect on it. <laughs> All right, lower the rest up. There was another one over here. That'll do it. Get the best of me. Three out of six, and one we could actually do. That's not that nice. Let's see have fun with that. Not so bad. Once we have the opportunity, carry on. A really good time. It's funny with that magical platform. We had a little effect. All right, might as well actually do what I came to do. Activate the statue. We catch on back up. Nice green smoke from that. Yeah, the flue flames. That's cool. And mysterious infinite stamina. It just happens sometimes. Hey, you just get it back out of nowhere. That's weird. Unless it's like disconnecting it on purpose. I have no idea. <laughs> Maybe it's invisible bubbles or something. I don't I don't get it. Could be any number of reasons. Things I don't know about. Turn sharply. Don't run into them. But, well, I guess that's it. All right. Ah, uh, get my plants. Some eggsies. And cows to say hello to. Would you like a nice little love tap? Oh, cut your hair. <laughs> Give you a little shave, you'll be fine. Nah, I don't mind. They are not actually injured or hurt by that. Does it affect them negatively at all? You just play with the animals. They don't mind. A little gentle magic on them. Ice cube cows. It doesn't do anything, actually. Alright, what good challenge we got here? The mandrake was good as like a longer stun, so... I wouldn't mind stockpiling them or growing them. Watch two enemies with the pull, so... I can do that. Almost. It was too far away. So I've seen Billy Wiggs. I've seen Billy Wiggs. Careful now. Still didn't work. Launch two enemies simultaneously with the pizza. This is too far away. Let me try this again. If I get them really close together, there's no way it can't look. It won't work. Ow. How is that not launching them, though? Didn't I get that upgraded <laughs> to pull? So, hold on. Hold on a moment. I was pretty sure I got upgraded to pull, so... Uh... 
Yeah, here it is. To pull some mastery. I just got there last time. Yeah, I decided to pull some instead of Accio Mastery. Re releases an additional blast directly around you. Okay, so it's not like the other ones where it affects both of them. It's in your proximity, so... So yeah, that is useful information. That's how you do it. Yeah, it was just a matter of, yeah, the different effects, so... We got it. Incendio. All right, clean them up quickly enough. Your blood's on Ranrock's hands. Don't need the ancient magic. Still going to activate the statue and the waypoints leading me to that. Okay. All right, I got level 26, so I do have that extra gear to use now. Let me put that on. Is it this one? No. It is this one. Upgrade defense by two. Can have that business casual clothes, but I'm liking that well enough. Better than the bow tie one, I think. For our character, at least. Uh, moving on. Into the rocks. <laughs> Activate the statue. We've been trying to get her out of that. It's just so many things to do in the area. Just enjoying it a bit. Nothing wrong. Having fun. Enjoy the ride. There we go. Ancient statue. 20, uh... Holy Grail ashes to collect. What are these? That's not even something I... Started. They're just like here. Well, halfway done, whatever it is. I'll do that before even <laughs> activating it, I guess. Okay, are they all in plain sight or do we have to look for them? Four to go, so it can't be too many. Rebellion. Too hard to find. Oh, yeah, some of them hidden. Expelliarmus. Basic castle do the trick. Incendio. Can't get through that. For whatever reason. Well, we've almost got to activate the statue. Momentarily. Nice. You could base the cast on the broom, but not how it works. Oh, some stuff over there. And that's the 20th one, so. What? <laughs> I didn't even activate it, and it's done, so. Alright. Good enough. That's kind of funny. It might have talked to me or something. I have no idea. That's it. <laughs> I should tell Madam Twiddle about I what solved the puzzle without even starting the puzzle. Okay. Let me grab these things. Never know how much lace weed flies. Oh, I guess I'm full or something? Don't well, let me grab any more, so. I must be full up on uh, lace wing flies. I never activated it, so. I hope yeah. I didn't miss anything interesting. Battle Arena? What is that? Oh dear. I didn't know you were gonna go in there. Thought it'd just be in the courtyard. What is this? South Coast Battle Arena. Never even been introduced to this. But here we go, apparently. See how long we can last. Oh, not a freaking troll to start. Probably don't get any more of these throwables each round, but. The trolls are no easy pickings. Hard to tell when it's unavoidable or not. What is casting at me? Taste of your own medicine. That should do a good bit of damage. Ah, oh, he still hit me though. That was nuts. That was nutty. He's not one of the easier enemies, the metaphor is trolling like is more dangerous than these, but still pretty tough. Ow. Hit me like a train. Try to get back. Ow, I came out of nowhere. 
Don't want to die of the first enemy, do we? Oh boy. Get some nice dudes here sometimes. For now, two minutes. Hulking bird. Yeah, I don't even know where this came from. Oh shit! Probably no stuff in here. That's the point of it being battle arena, isn't it? That's plenty of mongrels. These are tougher in numbers. That's for sure. Trying it out. I've never heard of this before, so. I can try it, I guess. We'll see what can be done for the little few minutes left. Battle arena out of nowhere. Enjoy suffering, Yeah, I didn't think that would matter. You are terribly up there. Surely you can see that. Operating like madmen. That student defeated our encampment in the tower. Expelling. Should I cast for the tongue? But... Ah! I got a maneuverability here. Do a tongue trick again. Do the tongue trick. <laughs> Do the tongue. Ow. Wow, that hit me. Yeah, I'll run out of potions eventually, but... I'm using it. Ow. Damn, can't switch spell bars fast enough at this point. How many potions I have, but... Uh, Good enough, apparently. Just back and forth. Oh, your tongue. Good friend, Use the tongue. Good friend, Good. Yep, yeah, dead. I was messing around a bit too much. What do you mean? Oh, he actually needs to get through it all. Okay. <laughs> you don't actually go until you die. You go until you finish it. So, now we know that. Oh, I wasn't really prepared for it. I didn't really want to use too many resources for it. Just for it. They're just kind of random in the first place. I just wanted to see if the statue would talk to me, basically. But next time, we'll be ready to go all out, I guess. That's fine. <laughs> I just don't like to waste potions and stuff. Only normal difficulty. That'll be a hard one on hard difficulty. There's no stealth involved, so you really have to know your combinations. I can have some more efficient uh, spell rows, I'm sure. Could even look up some advice on that, because I'm sure there's just certain combinations are better than others. I definitely don't need the uh, defensive ones in the middle of the offensive ones, so I should probably balance that out right away. I've just kind of been lazy and getting by without it so far. But, you know, lessons to be learned. We didn't lose any progress. Let's return to her for now, and yeah, we will come back to that battle challenge here very soon. So I improve the spell bars, not be so stingy on resources, just use the Wigan Welds. I didn't actually lose any because we didn't pass that one. Use the Wigan Welds, invisibility, 
Endurus, probably all we need. Endurus potions, that's really all you need for stuff like that. So we'll look forward to it. You know, plenty of chances to beat stuff like that. Doesn't have to be done right away. It's rather dark in there. Nothing to prove, you know. We'll get what we need. I keep saying that's like a treasure wall. I guess it is. Let me look at that again. It says on the map that is indeed a treasure room, so. Let me head back to it. Is that a chest? Chest behind the chimney. Rebellion. Behind the fireplace. Kraken cloak. Oh, that's kind of cool. There we have the dragon hide. There's the uh, Merlin treasure vault that keeps saying is in this vicinity. <laughs> I don't know what it really wants me to do. We'll see. After these Wizard guys. Kind will submit to us once the war is over. You're with the damn chain, guys. Okay, then. Too late for you to learn the error. Rebellion. Nothing much here, but. Search through binding to another upgrade I can't use yet. Those see blow up, right? Oh, not without it being activated over here. Seems straightforward enough. Just I'm not in trial when I see one. Blow up statues. Don't know how much more malice would I have, but while I have it, I will use it. There we go. Incendio. Confringo. Yeah, you do need Confringo for that. Possible to do without Confringo. Defendo, Defendo doesn't even work. Glacius doesn't work. Pulso doesn't even work. Accio. Depulso. Kinda surprised the pulse does it. Confringo is the only powerful miss powerful enough missile. Right. Where's that last one? Right in front of me. Then we'll go in those tunnels, I guess you can't fly in there, so. That's that. After all, Marlin. Excellent. Does he show you if you stand on it? That'd be kinda of funny, but basically hides your character at that point, I think. Just hides your character from the cinematic. You know we're right next to good old Merlin. Depulso. Good stuff. Alright, what is in here? I'm this curious. Could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Rebellion. This is probably a quest later on or something, but get those early loots, never hurt. No real need, but at the same time I'm curious. We'll turn to Althea here in a moment. Doesn't look like you can go much further than this anyway, so. Just to take a look. Alright, that's it for that for now. Probably come back and go down there or something. Or find a way to go further, but. Just to take an initial look at it. Likely something you get to later on. Alright, Althea, how do you like that puzzle solved? Just breaking jars, really, little ash urns. Still interesting enough, though. Maybe when you're a friendly area, you get an infinite stamina or something. That would make sense. Level 2. Should I sell to you? Rebellion. Got lots of stuff in to Hello, go Mamora. help for now, but has been a fun hour and a half stream. Get some exploits up Saturday tomorrow. We'll look forward to that stuff tomorrow for sure. We'll get that clip up tonight of Jurassic Park and announce for a fantastic sub Saturday, whatever the themes are. We shall look forward to hopefully chat with a good amount. Dragon Knights, Dragon Champions then. Oh, hello. <laughs> Don't mind me barging in on you, eating your cupcakes. Who is this? <laughs> oh man, just barge into some married couple's house. Who would like to block you? Block your movements. Just your friendly neighborhood wizards. Hey, checking in on you, making sure you're fine. <laughs> That's great. Uh, yeah, I'll sell the stuff next time. We, we didn't have too much here. 
Got a room requirement. You have to sell outside of that, but Althea, we got it. Mrs. Twiddle, your husband was right. The statue was part of a puzzle. Oh, really? How exciting! Yes, <laughs> I had to destroy a number of large vases, and that seemed to activate some sort of charm on the statue. Well done! Oh, I miss having someone like you around with a thirst for knowledge and a quick mind. Well, my curiosity has been satisfied. Thank you for that. Who knows what I'll encounter on my next constitutional. Oh, my husband would be so pleased to know he was right about that statue. Alrighty, safe for now. Looking good. Pick it up tomorrow. Gonna be a great day of it. We'll have a other rehearsal to do in the afternoon, but should be a good time for uh, sub Saturday throughout the evening. And we'll pick it up then, guys. Got to be great. Got to be lovely. Hope you have a good night for now. Catch you soon. So long, farewell. I'll be just saying good night. Good times tomorrow evening. We shall look forward to it. And it will be great. Work out just fine. Schedule before Sunday and other stuff. We'll see. Bit by bit. Gonna be great. Good times tomorrow evening. We shall look forward to it. And it will be great. Work out just fine. Schedule before Sunday and other stuff. We'll see. Bit by bit. Gonna be great.